Hey there, Steve Rubis with another installment of Capital Markets Investor Relations in two minutes or less. Today we're going to talk about what the Children's Place saga can teach public company management teams. So what happened at Children's Place? They reported a disastrous fourth quarter 23 earnings result. And it sort of revolves around this idea that they had guided to a positive 2.5% operating margin and came in at a negative 8.5% operating margin, which triggered a bunch of liquidity issues. The day of the pre-announcement, the shareholder base churned completely. And over the next seven days, that shareholder base, complete shareholder base, churned four times. That's unheard of. The stock started at 20, went to 850, rose to 38, and settled at 29. That's a roller coaster that no investor or management team wants a part of. So there are four key takeaways for public company management teams from this situation. And the first is a quarter off can be catastrophic. You can't afford to have your business go south or not execute on your business in a given quarter, especially if it leads to the second point. Liquidity always matters. If you are sensing a disruption in your business that could lead to a liquidity event, you need to get ahead of that as soon as possible. And that leads to the third point. You always need to know your shareholder base. Are there strategic shareholders that you can call on when you need to raise capital to address a liquidity need? And that can help you solve this crisis. And then finally, strategic alternatives. In this case, it's kind of interesting that they announced strategic alternatives on February 9th. And by February 15th, a third party ended up with 55% of the company. Clearly, that investor must not have signed an NDA with the investment bank that was hired to run a process. Interesting timing. I'm not sure how this all fits. But the bottom line takeaway is this. Don't be the management team that guides to 2.5% positive operating margin and comes in at a negative 8.5%. This situation, and if you find yourself in this situation, needs to be disclosed immediately. You can't wait. You have to get this out as soon as possible. Otherwise, you're going to churn your entire shareholder base four times and you're not going to be very happy. Always here to help you with your capital markets, investor relations, and corporate finance needs.